it's Ian from RTL here. Welcome to Pick and Mix, where you get something different every week. And this week it's called it's in the camera review. So we're going to look at we usually look at a concert that was came out on VHS or date or DVD. Now today's actually came out originally on a VHS video, and I got it when it came out. And we're talking about the recital of the script from Marillion. Now this first came out um, in on VHS tape back in October of 1983. And then in April, so that's this is what came up. But in 1984, in April, there was a supplemented video EP. This one which contained two other tracks, one being the web and the other being the 19 minute epic that is Grendel. But in 2003, it did come out on a DVD and they, they combined the both tapes and uh, the DVD also contained two other tracks, footage from an interview that Fish recorded at the marquee. Now, I've got it on my box set of um, recital of the script so that's where I um, watched it so playing on here we got Fish on the vocals Mr Stephen Rothery on guitars Mark Kelly on the keyboards Peter Trubavis on the ba bass and Michael P.T. Pointer if you know if you know remember the thing you know where I've got that from so it all opens up and we start off with the cover of script for a justice tear going round in the bed sit and then they go to a little telly in the corner which it sparkles into life and we go straight into that gig at the Hammersmith Odeon and uh, script for a justice tear comes on now the first thing you notice about this how young they look I mean Mark Kelly looks about 10. Now he's got such a young face. And then we have this wonderful, wonderful version of script for a justice tear. Um, it's still a fantastic song even to this day. What more do you need? So, up next. The fish in his in his paintwork and his hassock uh, dress type thing that he used to wear when thing and he says this is a party and to start the thing garden party classic the only thing I think about this is a little bit slower than the studio version for some reason um, but of course the crowd take over for I'm punting I'm really I'm in and so welcome and all that uh, what a great track. Uh, the guitar solo from Steve's brilliant on that. Up next is Chelsea Monday. And while you do notice how shy Fish is, <laughs> I think he was, I think that's why he, had, he said he had the paint on because it sort of hides behind the paint. But it is a great version of um, Chelsea Monday. The wonderful bass of uh, Pete on that, that boom, 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 and that drum beat from Mick is brilliant. Uh, it's a fantastic version. Then up next, it's the drug song, um, He Knows You Know. And this he tells the little story about, he told the pa page parent, they told their parents they'd be on top of their pops with this one. But it wasn't, and he said, this is the close one. He knows you know. Um, I do like this. This it is probably the best guitar solo on on this part of it. It's an absolute delta from Steve Rothery. Up next is the epic version of Forgotten Sons. Um, Fish does his little spiel at the beginning. I'm not going into that because it's a bit political. Um, but this is better than on the script album. Um, how, when this guitar bit starts, you get into the dramatics of Fish. You've got that lovely keyboard. 
and then he comes on strides with a khaki jacket, a helmet, turns his microphone stand into like a machine gun, and Mick was doing that rat -a -tat -a -tat of the thing, and Fish was doing all that. Very moving, just a poignant, and it's one of my favourite songs on this video. Um, up next is the classic Market Square Hero. Uh, it's just a great song, isn't it? Um, what you get on here that doesn't happen, before you get the I Am Your Antichrist bit, you get um, fish playing some tom-toms, which he, he did on that first couple of tours. He used to do when thinking of, because Pete used to introduce on vocals and percussion fish. Um, oh, this is one of the first time, uh, first time we heard the new lyric added to Market Square Hero as well. Um, so that closed the original VHS video. But as I said, in, a, in the April, this came out, the EP, and it starts off with this. With, of course, it's the same sort of uh, opening to the recital of the script, you get them in the thing and they go into the telly and then you get this absolutely brilliant version of Grendel. Um, it's one of my favorite songs, by the way. Well, lots of things in here. The guitar work from Steve is brilliant. Uh, Fish is absolutely on fire. And then you get it. The conclusion to this is absolutely brilliant where he puts on that mask. Now, apparently, that mask was on loan from a, from a museum that accidentally, on purpose, didn't get back to the museum. But then he picks up that lad from the crowd. Now, that lad looks... He looks absolutely thrilled and scared to death in the same, in the same moment. And I think this is probably the best guitar solo from Steve Rothery ever absolutely brilliant i love that i'm so glad it's now on part of the package of the dvd blu-ray it sounds absolutely brilliant on the blu-ray the sound is superb and this little one closes with the web one of the oldest songs in the marillion catalog brilliant This is about the in the bed sit, and this is the video where he destroys a rubber plant on stage. <laughs> Strange, isn't it? Um, but what I like about this, I think this again is the definitive version of the web. There's so much, especially when they start that riff with uh, with Steve Rothery. It's got more depth and more atmosphere than on the on the studio version just love the that that junker 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 and the crowd are going absolutely bonkers um absolutely brilliant so there we are that's i did it like that because that's how i saw it when it first came out now what do i think of this i think you can tell i love this um i think of all my Meridian concerts and bits I've got on the D. This is the best. It's just got some of the definitive versions of them songs off the script for a Jester's Tear. It's the best version of Grendel. It's the best version of Webb, Forgotten Sons. Um, and I still like playing this. I put it on last week just to have a raid camp because I don't need to do much rechearsing to this because it just flows. So, of course, this is getting a 10 out of 10, because the more I watch it, I don't get tired of watching this and watching this performance. So there we go. That's it for today on videos, and uh, we'll be back tonight at 8 p.m., of course, British Summer Time, for a bit of a, a chinwag and showing our Greatest Hits albums. But if not, we'll be back tomorrow. And we're going to have a live album ranking. And it's a little bit of a proggy sort of day tomorrow. Firstly, we're going to do the live albums of a, of a very good American prog rock metal band, Fates Warning. Uh, a really good band. And also tomorrow, we've got a brand new album. And it's the brand new album from Nectar, Mission 
Jupiter, Mars. Very short album. I've only got about six tracks on it, but boy, is it good. So that's it. So have a great day, everybody, and hopefully the weather will improve or, or someone will switch the lights on outside. Bye for now.